So the stealth range looks like it's going to be a thing of the past very soon, as it looks like it's going to be replaced by this TaylorMade QI10 for the 2024 season. And this image that has been floating around the internet in the last couple of days is the only thing that has been released so far. And you can find this on the USGA website, as it shows a full list of every conforming driver that's legal to play in competition, along with some of the specs that it is available in. Now the USGA do only post black and white pictures, so we don't actually know what the colour scheme of it is going to be just yet but what we do know for a fact is that it is going to have a carbon face again which i'm quite happy to see but i'm not too sure many others will be but this head will be available in 8 9 or 10.5 degrees as usual it's also worth noting that the model in the picture is an ls version so that's probably standing for low spin and just looks like the direct replacement for the plus and i think that's because they do want the pros to be putting it into the bag in these next couple of weeks and for a driver to be legal to play it does have to go to the usg to be tested first where they'll just check that it has legal components and everything on it is just within the rules so i'd keep an eye out for what McElroy, scheffler and fleetwood are using over the next couple of weeks i have heard a couple of people saying that it is going to be blue but it will be interesting to see what they're playing regardless just with everything that has been said about the stealth in the past year or two but what can we take away from this image i think the big question is what will the qi 10 stand for and what will the meaning behind this driver be this time i think the most likely thing is that it's going to have something to do with the moi and i think they will be focusing a lot around the forgiveness with this so every club has an moi number and the higher the number the more forgiveness that that club's going to have and that is measured in grams per centimeter squared so for example the ping that are known for being the most forgiving brand their g430 driver has a record of 10,000 grams per centimeter squared of moi compared to the stealth 2 which was around 7,500 grams so the thinking there is that the qi 10 means something to do with over 10,000, which would make it one of the most forgiving drivers ever made but when you do that you are going to be sacrificing some distance which you just can't really see tailor wanting to do too much of another theory that I've seen someone comment about is that the QI could stand for quantitative imaging, which is a type of artificial intelligence, so I believe. And with the way that a lot of other clubs are going, specifically with Callaway ones, that wouldn't be too unsurprising to have it meaning something like that. And then if you Google what QI means, it could either mean one of two things, really. One being, and I quote, the energy in everything, or in Chinese, it stands for the life force that every person or thing has, which TaylorMade could find a way of tying both of them things in with their clubs. But that's basically all that I have on this driver so far. Cobra and Ping have also listed one onto the USG conforming site. If you want me to cover them briefly as well, just let me know in the comments. But anyway, I'm looking forward to trying this when it probably does come out in January. Thanks for watching as usual, and I'll see you all in the next one.